There's one thing I want you to do for me. What? Come here. What? Win. Are you crying? No. Are you? No. I'm a little emotional. I'm holding it together. Jeez. Get a grip, buddy. What? Howdy, folks. Welcome on back to you, me, and the movies. And it's time to put on the gloves again. Ding, ding. Sweet. 15 more rounds with Rocky. Rocky 2. Can't wait. Well, what are you expecting from the sequel to Rocky? More boxing. More boxing? There wasn't much boxing in Rocky No, there really wasn't, which is why I'm expecting more boxing in this one. You were pleasantly surprised by the first movie, actually. Yeah, I didn't think I was going to love it that much, but I I really did. It was more of a love story than about boxing. Yeah, well, this is three years later, 1979, when this came out. Okay. And yeah, Rocky II. Well, let's get into it. Yeah, let's do it. Let's ring the bell. But first, like, comment, subscribe. Come hang out with us for Rocky II. It could be fun. It could be fun. <laughs> wow. So enthusiastic today. <laughs> and check out our Patreon link down below if you want early access to our videos, full link commentary, or access to polls helps pick where we watch next. Link's down there. Check it out. We also have Twitter and Instagram, so if you're into social media, join us. Join us. And if you're not into social media, don't join us. Just hang out with us here. Yeah. Let's watch Rocky 2. Here we go. Combination. What is keeping him up, Bill? I don't know. Yeah, he's like a weeble. Weebles wobble, but they don't fall down. Oh. Do you remember this from last week? Yeah. Okay. You're bleeding inside, Sam. Oh, I'm gonna stop the fight. Hey, you Listen, man. Listen, man. You say you're bleeding inside? Yeah. I don't remember that from the first one. You were talking when they said mm. that. Probably. Rocky broke his ribs. Ain't gonna be no rematch. Ain't gonna be no rematch. The war one. Does that mean they rematch in this one? I don't know. Rocky don't want one. Money talks, really, so. Hey, you! Rocky! Hey, Jim! Rocky! Hey, where's your hat? Where's your hat? Hey, where's your hat? Everything's off-centered, just enough to make it weird. Ambulance is spelled backwards. Yeah. Is that a news van behind that ambulance? Yeah, I think this is directly after the fight. Oh, okay, so they're taking the champ to the hospital? Yeah, they might be. Or it could be Rocky in there. Directed by Sly this time. Oh. How's my nose look as bad as Mickey's? It ain't that horrible. What'd you think going into the last round? I don't know that I should have stayed in school or something. <laughs> Me? Get up out of that chair, Chump, and let's finish this fight right now. Oh, don't please no, I'm down. Talking. Is he serious? <laughs> hey, sure has a lot of energy. You know, you got nothing to prove. I don't care what the hell them judges said. This is the man I want to fight. I'm going to show you how lucky you are. You're going to fight me again, Chump. <laughs> what you got to prove? I'm being fixed my nose. I'm a little depressed. You guys should have seen this tonight. You did good. I always wanted you know, you should have seen it. The good night. You had him in the tent, and in the 15th... As these are finally kicked in, shut him up. Good. My kid would die for your autograph. Uh, sure. Would you sign it, please, to uh, my good friend, Charlie Flynn? It's my first autograph. Thank you. You're welcome. My good friend Charlie Flynn, who I don't even know. <laughs> Could you answer me one question? Yeah, sure. Could you give me your best? Yeah. Yeah. 
His wife, he went easy on him. Yeah. Surprised he was honest. Hey, Rock. Rock. hey how you doing? Hey, could, could you sign my head? Yeah, sure. <laughs> I'll call you. You got a number? No, yeah, I just call you. I go, hey, yo. Okay. So I'll call you. All right, I'll <laughs> call. Here. Guy's got brain damage. Yeah. Yes, definitely his brain damage, but he's just got better things to do right now. Yeah. He's not so worried about money. What are we doing here at the zoo? Well, uh, you know, I kind of like this zoo a lot. You know, it's a special place, especially when it snows. You know, it kind of smells clean and everything like that, you know? Don't you like smells that? clean. <laughs> All the piss and shit's frozen, so you can't smell it. It's great. <laughs> I was wondering if uh, you wouldn't mind marrying me very much. What'd you say? If you wouldn't mind marrying me too much. <laughs> he asked her to marry him in the eye of the tiger. Oh. You want to come? You can get out for the weekend. I'll send you an invitation, Mr. Tiger. Defendere Adriana Penino, qui presente per la vostra moglie. Yeah, absolutely. Yes. Quei presente per vostro marito. I do. Thanks. Io ti God bless you. Uh, thanks, Father. You've done real good. I'm proud of you. Okay. <laughs> hey, Tony, I just got married in here. I know, and I'm happy for you. How's about investing in condominiums? It's safe here. Condominiums? Yeah, condominiums. I never use them. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we're lucky this wasn't a shotgun wedding, huh? <laughs> You've been carrying her home since the church? <laughs> you know, I never knew you were so light, you know? Never? <laughs> no, if I did, I would have carried you everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I tried to do with you. You never let me. <laughs> First time I see you, I says to myself, I says, underneath them, uh, Sweaters and hat and what'd you have on? About 20 sweaters, was it? No, uh, three. Yeah, three sweaters is the best girl in Philly, you know? Uh, oh, yeah, I said that. I said that. Really? Oh, yeah. Just like the first time I saw you. You were wearing like five sweaters? I wasn't wearing any sweaters. I don't remember what, what I was wearing the first time I met you. I do. No, you don't. You think it'll always be like this? Yeah. Won't always be like that. You never get tired of me. Oh no. You get tired of me all the time. Never. Uh, yo. Nice car, right? It's a great car. Hey, here's the paper, right? Trans Am. Well, do you know how to drive? Do I know how to drive? Do you know how to drive? I'm one of the greats. Are you kidding? Come on, I'll just... <laughs> I'd drive you crazy if you give me a chance. You know what I mean? <laughs> she doesn't know how to drive. Does he have a license? Is that great? I look at this black thing here with a tiger on the back. You like animals? I love animals. Black, I like black. Black's kind of my favorite color. You want to buy them? Well, I say we get them before someone else buys them. What do you say? <laughs> well, hey, do you like having a good time? Huh? Then you need a good watch. <laughs> we'll take these. What about one, for one for me. One for you. Well, I can't tell time very good, but all right, I'll take it. <laughs> oh, look at that. Hey, Bunkers, look at that. Your neck looks great, huh? Is that neck? Hey, Gloria, you got something a little smaller, huh? Yeah. You see? Now, that's what I call class, huh? Yeah, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I, like I like these bricks. They're very nicely done here. They look very solid. Nice. Nice mailbox. I like this mailbox. You know, these numbers almost add up to nine here. I like that. That's a good omen. <laughs> they do add up to nine. Why? Well, yeah, I don't mind. I say we get the house now, huh? Yeah, but we need to go upstairs. I don't mind. It's just details. I'm sure it's nice. <laughs> Check the upstairs first. Does he even know how much he's got? Did he sign that contract? I think he made like 100000 from the fight. You didn't beat nobody, and anybody who knows boxing knows the fight was fixed. 
You call yourself the champ. You're a fake. Why can't you ignore it? Are you serious? Now imagine if it was on social media and you just got bombarded with millions of hate mail. Yeah, just publicly. Every minute. Everybody can see it on Twitter. <laughs> Why is it me? Come on, throw the ball, Swifty. Let me see your best here. I'm waiting for you. I'm waiting for you. <laughs> yeah? Yes. Yo, Adrian, you did it! <laughs> oh, you, you did, did it! I knew you had it in you. Woke up this morning, you had a smile on your face, and then something special's gonna happen today. I wasn't sure what. She's got a good clean hell. Clear <laughs> hell from the gynecologist. Yeah, that's what happened. <laughs> Not No chlamydia! <laughs> uh, you did it! <laughs> Who needs condominiums anyway? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Have to hire a bodyguard when she starts going to school to keep all the boys away. <laughs> uh -huh. and they didn't want to make a Rocky doll. You understand? You can kick it, you can beat it. For kids, you uh -huh. can kick it, you can beat it. It does everything. You smart, That's yeah. right. <laughs> Agent, how do I look? Different. <laughs> don't be nervous. Yeah. Well, how do I look? I look stupid, don't I? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Yes. In the morning, I splash it on, and it makes me smeal mainly. Smeal mainly? <laughs> smell manly? Can you read that, Rock? She don't read very good. Man, I mean, do you think this stuff smells like a man? I say absolutely no. Are you finished? I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> and it surrounds my face with class. Cut! It smelled like a jungle rat. Cat, I rat, cat. It looked a little like. He's not good scripted. <laughs> he needs to be coached. What to say. Rendezvous over to the other set, Rock, if you don't mind. Sure. We've only wasted four hours. Need a better director who doesn't just say action. You just need him to stand in there and go, ah! I smell manly. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> right? <laughs> No, being a good reader is going to help me get a good office job, you know. Want to hear some more? I can't wait. <laughs> Smokey, said Brad Lincoln, we better head for the canyon. You read nice. Louis Lamar books. Classic. Do you have a criminal record? Nothing worth bragging about. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I was a canine sometimes. Give me a kiss. It's got towels from the Holiday Inn. So, Rocky, if you want to work, it'll be from week to week, okay? Well, that's okay with me, but uh, when can I start? Uh, how about tomorrow? Well, how about today? Okay, we got a load coming in. Great. Hey, Polly, you look kind of skinny there, huh? Yeah. Did they switch to occupations? They sure did. Hey, please, man. Wait up. It's a big piece of sausage. I mean, he's going to be able to lift a lot of meat, right? Nailed it. Is he allowed to take the meat home? Or is that going to get him fired? Polly will be brought home. He swears his hat backwards. <laughs> Right. I gotta let you go. Damn. Really, how about if I take a cut and pay, all right? Can't do it. Union rules. Fucking unions. Yeah. Listen, uh, boy, you wanna buy this car, you know? I thought you liked it. Nah, it's okay, but I don't need it no more. You know, I have a hard time making these right turns with my bad eye. I keep hitting trash cans and things like that. <laughs> okay, my sister giving you a hard time? You know, she is your break of teeth. Mm -hmm. I appreciate the advice, way to boy, treat your I wife. like her teeth, you know where they are. Yeah. <laughs> where you going? You need a lift? Get around. <laughs> How much did he pay him for it? It's just covering <clears throat> the payments, I guess. I got canned today. 
What are you gonna do? I don't know. I was uh, think about fight. What about you all? You know, the doctor said you shouldn't fight anymore. No, no. <laughs> he recommended I don't fight, and I recommend that I do. <laughs> Man, honest, I see great. I see like a beagle or something like that. <laughs> <laughs> see like a beagle. <laughs> I think he meant eagle. Yeah. <laughs> He doesn't see that good. He's, uh, beagles may be more appropriate. Rocky, you gave me your word you wouldn't fight anymore. I mean, if we need money, I could get a job. You don't have to do that. But I'm the one who's supposed to support. It's just for a little while. Real world sucks when you got a certain set of skills. Yeah. It's going to feel a little bit emasculated. And that just leads to resentment, which leads to marital problems. And that's tough. Love that he's wearing a jersey. The dog's wearing a jersey. <laughs> What's that in your ear there? What is it? Just, uh, I hear stupid things better. I hear stupid things better. <laughs> now, look, I want to show you something now. Test it. Now, look, you, you look uh, right there at the end of my nose. Now, when I bring my finger in, you tell me when you see it, okay. will you? I see it. Now, you see nothing. Creed would have caved in the whole side of your face. Now, forget it, kid. You got the heart, but you ain't got the tools no more. No. Is that right? That is right. Yeah? Well, maybe it's you who ain't got it no more, you know that? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Now, look. <laughs> if I can't fight no more, maybe I can help out around here, you know? I don't know how to say this, you know, just... I gotta be around it. It's his life for the last 10 years. It sucks for him. Let's go after some new meat. Forget this bum. You think I beat him the last time? Do you? Hmm? You got the decision. Man, I won, but I didn't beat him. You wanted to throw the towel on his trainer, dude. Mm -hmm. I saw you beat that man. Like I never saw no man get beat before, and the man kept coming after you. And we don't need that kind of man in our life. <laughs> Let it go. You're the champ. You don't feel like a champion when you know there's a man that can beat you. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You snarl on your punches. Wait a minute. Hey, Rock. Rock, come here a minute, will you? Show this Latin language. Not a snarl and punch, sorry, man. Now you can take it. Whoop. Hey, can't you think of anything tougher to say than oops? <laughs> Come on, say, hit that right thing. Well, I'd start by creaming that guy. That ain't my brand. Huh? I like oatmeal. Hey, listen. <laughs> Why do cows wear bells? Because the horns don't work. <laughs> they really used to like it in third grade. I used to break everybody up with that one. <laughs> have to tell Chuck that one. Yeah. You know, Adrian, sometimes I look at Buckus and I don't think he's a normal canine. Well, what do you think he is? I don't know. He just don't look like a regular dog to me sometimes. <laughs> this would be a legitimate rematch. The boxer against the puncher, and I think everyone wants to see them back in the ring together. But there's only one problem. Where is Rocky Balboa? I'm Brent Musburger. I'll leave from! Jeez. Piss a mick off. You just got milk and cookies all over. Rocky, please. You don't have to prove anything. I never asked you to stop being a woman, you know. I'm asking, please, don't ask me to stop being a man. Would you let him fight? Yeah. I think we ought to knock his block off. Absolutely. Rocky. I'm sorry. Let's do it. 
I want all of Philadelphia, I want all of America, I want the whole world to see me destroy this man after two short rounds. Because after this fight, he's going to have to donate what's going to be left of his body to science, but there won't be much. That I can guarantee. Right? Rocky. That's aggressive. <laughs> Do you think you have a chance this time against Apollo? I don't know. It looks pretty mad. <laughs> Apollo Creed will provide the ultimate gala spectacle on Thanksgiving in front of this man's home crowd. Thanksgiving. Rocky, your pay for the fight is very substantial. What are you going to do with the money? Well, the first thing I got to do is I got to pay the rent, you know. <laughs> and then, well, I made this list on the way over. I was just thinking. <laughs> and uh, some Muppet toys, you know, Ernie and Big Bird and that, that frog. What's his name? Kermit or something like that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And uh, I think a snow cone machine for you, Paul. You like snow cones, don't you? <laughs> how about some clowning shots, Apollo? Yeah, how about clowning Does this look like a circus to you, man? A little bit. A little bit like a circus. You got guts to go back in the ring with him, kid. Thanks a lot, Nick. <laughs> to pull this miracle off, you gotta change everything. You gotta learn to be a right-handed fighter. Now this will confuse Apollo, and it'll protect that bad eye. You start fighting right-handed, and then you change suddenly, and that'll make history. But first, you gotta get speed. Demon speed. Speed's what we need. We need greasy fast speed. All right. It's a greasy fast speed. You have to wear that stinking sweatshirt. Well, it brings me luck, you know. You know what it brings? It brings flies. <laughs> <laughs> well, what do I got to chase a chicken for? It's embarrassing, you know. First, because I said so. <laughs> 500 times. Hey, Mick, I want to use my other arm. If you do, I'm going to chop it off. <laughs> Four. I want 500 high ones. Go! What was I, seven or eight? Seven. Paul is taking this very seriously. He's gonna run out of sparring partners. Let's take a break, okay? Break? What break? Where, where are you going? We're not finished. He doesn't seem too enthralled by the training. He's not training very hard. Maybe he doesn't care if he loses. He just wants the money yeah. for the fight. He needs Adrian to be okay with it. Is what that's what's that's what's the problem, right? Maybe. He doesn't feel right unless Adrian supports him. Oh, come on, I'm doing okay. Come on, my sister got you so guilty you're running all over the place. How's he gonna get Adrian on his side, though? I don't know, but I don't like Polly. Yeah, don't tell me! He's gonna get hurt because of you! Not true. Don't say that! Come it's not alright, Polly. If he goes blind, you walk away. I can't. I love him. You don't! What are you doing? What's wrong? Adrian, what's the matter? <gasps> Hey, Rock, they want you across the street. What's the matter? Your wife's sick. Too much work. Too much stress. Too much stress, yeah. Don't worry about nothing. You just sleep as long as you want, okay? And I'm gonna be here when you wake up. Let's go see the kids. Hey, don't we want? No, we, we gotta see him together. Doesn't want to see his kid. Not without her. Mr. Balboa. Visiting hours are over. Visiting hours for spouses? Hospitals were different back then. Yeah. Mick's just hanging out with him everywhere now. <laughs> White pointed towards Marvel, who was leading the horses to the corral. I want a book on tape by Rocky. <laughs> I just wrote this thing for you, Adrian. I don't know. Maybe you like it. I'll just read it because, uh, but I kept giving you lip and you kept trying to slip so I could catch you. He's a poet now. Beautiful.
Hey, you haven't seen the baby? No, come on. I was waiting I to see, see him together. Kid. Hey, the kid's a winner. He's got four arms like him. Here he is now. Look. Oh, no. oh, my baby. Uncle Polly's oh, seen him. Baby. Look at that head of hair. <laughs> That's a newborn, too. Oh, no, he ain't got a name. What do you want to call him? Paulie's a great name. Yeah, Paul, Paul's a pretty good name. <laughs> There's one thing I want you to do for me. What? Come here. What? Win. There you go. Win. That's all he needed. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Take this. Are you crying? No. Are you? No. <laughs> Looks like, what are we waiting for? Mm -hmm. This movie gets me. I'm a little emotional. I'm holding it together. Jeez. Get a grip, buddy. What? That's how I do sit-ups. Make the girls slap my belly as I'm doing sit-ups. <laughs> Got the chicken. Look at all that friggin' hair. That's a cute baby. She got speed. The baby? Yeah. Absolutely. He got his trans Trans Am back? His Trans Am was sitting there. Polly probably never even took it from him. Fifty kids went missing today after chasing <laughs> Rocky Balboa down downtown Philadelphia. <laughs> The parents are still looking for them. Oh no. Two kids fell there. They probably got trampled. It's probably like Thanksgiving break. They're all out of school. It's like, I'll never let a kid beat me. <laughs> It was the 70s, so kids just kind of did what they wanted. Yeah. As long as they were home before dark, right? Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is Bill Baldwin. Speaking oh, to it's you the day. The Super in... Fight 2. Sounds like a video game. Okay, you just take care of everything now because you're in charge. Take right? care of the dumb house. You're going to be late for your own fight. <laughs> Father Carmine! Hey, yo, Father Carmine! Okay, yeah. I was wondering, you know. If you could throw down a blessing so that if I get beat up tonight, you know, it won't be too bad, you know? Could you do something like that? <laughs> Thanks a lot, Father. Listen, I appreciate it. I gotta go. I'm so late. I'll see you. <laughs> Father's like, I got the TV on here. The fight's about to start. His tardiness is making me very anxious. Hey, Rock. Good luck, son. Don't miss. Hey, I know. Break your head. <laughs> well, the most obvious being a definite desire for Apollo to draw first blood to end it quickly. Who you betting on? Rocky, of course. Mm -hmm. You bet on Rocky the first from a fight. I did? Yeah. Yeah. But he, he didn't win. Well, he put up a damn good fight. Still betting on him. Hey, Mick. Yeah, hey, Mick. Yeah. In case I don't get a chance, I just want to say I'm going to be trying hard for you today, okay? <laughs> Ain't this robe nice? Better than last year, that's for sure. Remember that baggy one last year? This is gorgeous. It's perfect. Yeah, it's real cute. I like it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this area is certainly packed with Rockies people. No kidding. Yeah, like Creed's probably like, maybe this wasn't a great idea playing on his home turf. These people are for you, Rock. I appreciate it. Are you ready in here? I think so. Yeah. I think so. <laughs> This time than he did the last time. It's Apollo. Who'd you expect? I was hoping it wouldn't show. <laughs> You're going down, man. You're going down. Don't let it bother you, kid. Wouldn't it bother you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. He's not wearing red, white, and blue this year. It wasn't the biocentennial anymore, so... That's true. He's not feeling as patriotic this time, huh? Good fight. He's going down. Okay. <laughs> we'll see. He's like, sure. Whatever. Okay. ...the century, Superfight 2, and there's the bell. And the champion 
comes over to hurry now. <laughs> Again, he just lets him hit him in the face. I don't understand. <laughs> I mean, take a, I mean, like, throw a punch, Rocky. Good round. Good round. Can't believe it. What? I broke my nose again. This <laughs> dangerous. This man is dangerous. Man is dangerous. 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 That guy's great. No, no. He's getting his ass kicked. Paul is trying to embarrass him. Come on. Come on. Get up. I'm standing there. You threw a great second round. And they're taunting each other. Everybody in the audience better get ready for a World War Three. Paula wanted him in two. Didn't get him in two. What do you think Mick's going to have him switch to Southpaw? I don't know. Ow. Rocky gets better as the rounds get longer. How? I feel like he's going to have to knock him out if he wants to win this, right? How else is he going to win? I think he's definitely losing in points. Now listen, let me stop it, guys. Listen, you're getting killed out there. It's my life. Now switch now to Southpaw anyway, are you? No tricks, I ain't switching. Yeah, but you're fading out again. Why don't you switch? I don't need no tricks. All right, all right. Go I ain't switching. All right, we got a plan. <laughs> for the start of the 15th and final round. You're going down. No. Oh, no way. Oh my god. A knockout in the last round. Excuse me. Excuse me. I can't believe this has happened. Oh, he looks like he got hit by a fucking bus. <laughs> Yo, Adrian! I wonder how long he had to be in the hospital after that one. Yo, Adrian, I did it. <laughs> oh, man. He took a real face pounding. Yeah. I don't I don't really understand him. He just lets him hit, hit him in the face for yeah. a long time. It just makes time. him stronger. Just keep hitting me in the face. Yeah. All right. Rocky 2. Yeah. And he's now the world champion. Pretty cool. He's going to have lots of money now. Yeah. think so? Well, at least a nice little chunk of money for a while. Yeah. It should like be that, okay for a year or two. Even there at the end, Creed was pretty humble with the, the loss. Yeah. And, like, raising his arm for him and stuff. So, yeah. At some point, you have to admit that somebody might be better than you, you know, mm -hmm. if you get your ass kicked by them. Yeah. Creed was kind of believing that, too, with all the letters. I think that's what rubbed him the wrong way. Is I think he believed everybody, telling him that Rocky actually won that fight. He yeah. only won because he was the champion. And they gave Somewhere it to inside, him. he knew that he he maybe lost it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. well, what would you think? I think it was okay. I mean, it wasn't as good as number one, I don't think. Okay. Um, maybe drug a little bit longer than yeah. number one. It's a little slower rolling. The pregnancy drama. Yeah. And her coma. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They probably didn't need to keep that all. They could have cut that in yeah, half. It did mix it up a little bit more, though. Yeah. It's a little different than the first one. Yeah, for sure. But it was still good. Yeah. You got the chicken. You got the he speed. Caught the fucking chicken. He's world champion. And he can box in two directions. Yeah, he's he only box left the Even last round. I don't think he did. He refused to. Did he go right handed the whole time? Yeah. Huh? He said, I don't need uh, no tricks. I don't need no tricks. All right. So I can't wait to see next movie when he does switch it around a few yeah. times, I imagine. 
think he's gonna, that would have to be confusing. Think he's gonna have to fight Apollo again. Apollo's gonna want a shot at the. I don't think they'll bring Apollo back, back for a while. So what's your guess for Rocky Three then? Well, now that he's the champ, he's gotta take all the all the new challengers. Right. Yeah. Okay. What was your favorite part about this one? Just the whole the the drama of Adrian waking up and telling him to win for her. I got me. Yeah, it sure did. I've seen this before. I just, I just, just something about their relationship that. Yeah, it's it's nice, it's sweet. Yeah. Well, what should people comment on after Rocky Two? You ever caught a chicken? Can you catch a chicken? Mm, good one. And how difficult would it be to learn to fight opposite-handed? You've totally you know, different muscle memory. Yeah. I imagine tricky. Where's this stack up? Better than Rocky One. What yeah. do you think? Where's this rank, th- rank in, in your Rocky? rankings right also like comment subscribe thanks for hanging out for rocky 2 yeah and check out our patreon link down below for early access to our videos for commentary access to pulls up so pick we watch next links down there check it out until next time have a good one bye